chap on um, on Instagram. His name is Dwarka. He's on, he's known as District Arushi. Oh yes, yes. So yeah, he yeah. did the, this pen. I saw him last year at the DC show. Okay. And he'd started working on the cap. It's yeah. um, gold foil. Uh, yeah. The pen itself is, I think, is a, is a Ranga or yeah. one of the Ebonite, yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, the Jovo. Mm. Yeah. But the quality of his work really nice, is it? really good. Yeah. Um, and I think, you know, he's up and coming. He started to do Raden work wow. as well. So, I mean, I, I was really... Yeah. I mean, he sent me that when I went to LA because he was finishing off the barrel. Wow. And when I got it, I was um, yeah, very, nice very, very... Um, Pleasantly surprised. So, good luck, Duarca, if you're watching. Yeah. Uh, you know you have to pass various exams yes. before they let you so sign you anything. <laughs> but I'll let you off because you're not Japanese. It's not Japanese. They probably lock you up if you sign to me in Japan. Probably. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> you don't happen to have a name for one of those. <laughs> no. No. That is good. Send it back to Japan. Yeah, yeah. It's Japan. They'll have a website with a service. I mean, they'll probably say, please, this is what you should do, send your pen back, blah, blah, blah. Well, they're probably, I mean, they might. If they're, usually for something like that, they'll probably just charge you, like, postage, usually, or handling. I mean, if you, but these days, you can send them a picture and everything. Like, yeah. So, just say, I'm looking for that. They won't let you, they won't send you the part. You know, they'll have to, you'll have to send them the part. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. <laughs> Here's another pen that um, I could show you, uh, Dave. It's another one from uh, 2010, which is um, uh, an Edison Pearl, yeah. which is a project, project they did with 20 and they did 20 limited edition Urushi pens by Ernest Shin, right. Hakumin. Wow. This is a Kawanuri. It's taken me ages to get this. Um, absolutely beautiful little pen. Do you like your Urushi, don't you? Oh, Maki's. Yeah, Maki's. Yeah. Well, I think it's I think it's a combination of their, you know, yeah. very beautiful. Plus, yeah. When you think about the amount of work that's gone into it. Oh and, God, yeah. And there's nothing the amount of time and effort. Yeah about yeah. these and I, and I think yeah. that's what I like yeah. I love I love some of these these yeah, are yeah chinkin uh, fireflies beautiful one man. that's another chinkin I've got Namiki bamboo forest that's very nice yeah. platinum aurora oh, that is still 3776 still gorgeous I love that one <laughs> The Wieland, which is a Polish maker. Oh, yeah. Very cool, ebonite, um, Bakelite, wow. limited edition. Interesting yeah. designs. I like unusual stuff. You do, and you have a lot of unusual pens. Yeah, and some regular ones as well. Yeah. But your Namikis as well. Namiki Emperors, um, Danny Trios, the Genkai. This is a new one I got, new colour. Uh, I really, nice color. yeah, I like that. It's, it's one of the, it's part of the, um, the red, yeah, uh, the you know the red um, spectrum, but it's more of a terracotta, I think. Yeah, I'll say it's more terracotta. Yeah, yeah. But beautiful. Yeah. Genkai's are nice. Wow. Yeah, and then. I've got this one recently, which is an Amiki Emperor, but with, I, on, with the cat bands. I honestly bands. think it looks better in black than in, in the red. Yeah, but with the cat bands it's unusual. Yes, Some people it say is. it doesn't, um, yeah. it, it interrupts the flow, but I actually yeah. quite like that. I mean, no, it's I, a bit I more actually, of a classic look. I do prefer the cat bands. Yeah. Even with the Sailor King of Pens, I prefer yeah. the cat bands on them. I think it's a, your personal choice. I mean, it is, it, yeah. A lot of people don't like yeah, the cat bands, exactly. but I, I prefer them. Yeah. I keep an eye over here, mate. Definitely. <laughs> you got the camera as well, which is good. Yeah, yeah. Yes, get in there. The magic eye. <laughs> I'm gonna get two or three. With
perfect. Went through? Yeah. Perfect. So, um, thank you very much. I'm going to. You got your pelican? Yes. Yeah. Do you need a little baggie? No, I put it in my. Uh, if you I can uh, take my card and send me. I will a, drop you a line. Yeah. Drop me uh, an email. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Just the yeah. same as this. Yeah. And um, if I find it, I'm, I'm picturing it. It's a white. Not big. I, I think I have. It. I'm, I know I've got it for the uh, the golf and the Wall Street. I think the blue ocean is there as well. And I've definitely got it for this one because this is an American, very small, old style yes. box. But um, if I haven't, I'll drop you no Either back, way, so. no worries. But it's limited, so it's no good to me. You should have it if I've got it there. Yeah, so. Thank you. I appreciate it. <coughs> yeah. Hello. 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 You OK? Nice. That is nice, isn't it? It's number eight nib. It's a flame red diffusion bonded acrylic. Uh, number eight. Uh, lovely engraving on uh, yeah. the clip That's by Paul. Really nice yeah, but this was a prototype, so there's no classic uh, oh, okay. on the cap. And this is yeah, no, slightly no. longer oh, okay. than the new one. This was made in 2007. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Lambrew talks about it on his site. Yeah. I bought it from a collector quite recently, but I love it. That's good. Great colour. Yeah, I love the uh, LM1 and the uh, yeah. flame red. I yeah, really I mean, this is basically a, a chunkier LM1. Yeah, it is. With a fancier, obviously, sterling silver yeah, so and, and a bigger, bigger nib. Yeah, yeah. Wow. It's a nice pen. LM1s are like hen's teeth. Yeah, yeah, you can't get them. And they're 500 made. It's yeah. amazing. Yeah. So that's the two sides, okay. which refers to the size of the nib. Where are they from? 50s. Are they? Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Um, this is a, a 144. Okay. Um, not bad transparency. That one would be 1300. Really? God, that's yeah. amazing. Yeah. yeah. That's a really good one. Two size, I think you could do it for the 90. Right. That's this one. That's slightly smaller nib, smaller pen. I think it's outside my. Hey, well, they for the stripy ones, there. you yeah. have to pay. For the black yeah. ones, they're like four or five hundred. I've got a black one. Are they? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. For depending on which one. Not that one. What period is that from then? Same, fifties. Is it? And what, how much is that? One, this one is uh, eighteen hundred. Oh, so one four nine silver rings. Yeah. So it's got an eight. That's the transition. More time. How much is this one? The 146 has got a nice nib, this. Is it? Which is a... It's got a, it's a, a what they call a kugel nib, a round with flex. Um, I'll do that for... 480. Okay. But it's uh, it's interesting because this is the um, the Red Emperor, which I've got, but this is the one with the 1990s one. If you look at the difference in colour mm. between the current and the vintage. Yeah, it's a huge difference. Yeah, and this is, uh, the vintage has the, um, has the original uh, number 50 nib, yeah. not the one with Mount Fuji. Yeah. That's a beautiful pen. Emperai. Emperor or Emperai? Emperai probably, I think, isn't it? <laughs> Emperors. There you go, Dave, a little peek. Thank you. Into, uh, into Minhouse, that's it. <laughs> I tell you what. Minhouse Estates. <laughs> this is, yeah, I tell you, this is. If I ever sat down and worked out. Oh, well, but then again, you spend your money on what you like. I mean, yeah, it's, it's all do. disposable. I'm not. No, I haven't, you know, I haven't mortgaged the farm, as they say. Just mortgage the daughter's college funds. <laughs> They're all right. In the ski, spending the kids' inheritance. Yeah. <laughs> They're all, they've got pens to inherit. <laughs> it's very similar to the Madrid.
Vince, how are you doing? Hi, dear. How are you? Yeah, doing great. Feeling well? Are you feeling well? Yeah. Yeah. Good, good. No, Got loads of rods no, here. No symptoms? No, no not yet. No, yeah. Touch wood. Nobody else has got any symptoms? No, no. Are you enjoying the show? I am very much so. Good. The numbers aren't too bad, are they? No, it's pretty good. good vibe to it. Yeah. Yes. You've got a load of rods with you again. Yeah, I've got some ore mass. Yeah. Uh, some ore mass acrylic. Obviously not the cellulite. No. Yeah. Yeah. Conway is always popular, yeah. especially the dark, dark one, dark amber. Yeah. 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 We've got four o'clock, haven't we? Yeah, yeah. These are some nice... Some nice Jewel number 12, 14 covered gold Ooh. nibs. Oh, wow. Nice, aren't they? Lovely. Two-tone. Rhodium. How are you? come for? What one now? Alright, that's 10 pounds. Where have you come from? Do you, you live in London? Yeah, London. London it's easy London. for you, isn't it? Right, yeah, yeah, very easy. So you just walk? You no, just no, walk, like yeah. two, two. Oh, there's a bar over there, the big, big uh, villa. So that's where that is. You came from, so that's 1930s. Blue lizard. So John and then come here. And then this is the new this is a new cellulose acetate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Last one. Last one? Yeah. That was no good for you guys. Whether we like people, then it's much easier to get around. Fools. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Have you enjoyed yourself? I have. Uh, it's been frustrating. Everybody says that. Did he come one last year? Uh, no, I couldn't make it to one last year. Uh, well, the first one in London, yes. So, um, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 
manuscript. I got loads of them. I got loads as well. But, yeah. um, I just thought it was the way I was going to say it. Same old scares. I had a box of loads of well, yeah, it's just for sticking pins, isn't it? Yeah, it's just buy it and stuff the pen away. Why don't you think you're going to sell it? My daughter used to sell it. I didn't talk to you just because of the sale, you know. No, I know, but I actually um, like them all. I definitely have one of those. Where have you come from? Today, well, yes, I live in Surrey.